In this video, we're going to be learning about long division using two-digit divisors. Here is a number sentence. 154 divided by 14. First, we need to draw our bus stop. We put the number that we are dividing, the dividend, inside the bus stop. We put the number that we're dividing it by, the divisor, next to the bus stop. Now we know that 14 doesn't go into 1. So we need to start by seeing how many 14s go into 15. 14 times 1 is 14, so it goes into 15 once. So now we need to find out what's left over. So 15 take away 14 equals 1. We can now bring the next digit down. Now we need to see how many 14s go into 14. We know that 14 goes into 14 once. So the answer is 11. Let's have a look at another one. 7104 divided by 24. First, we need to draw our bus stop. We put the number that we are dividing, the dividend, inside the bus stop. We put the number that we're dividing it by, the divisor, next to the bus stop. Now we know that 24 does not go into 7. So we need to look at how many 24s go into 71. 24 times 2 is 48, and 24 times 3 is 72. So I can see that 24 goes into 71 two times. So now we need to find out what's left over. 71 take away 48 equals 23. We can now bring the next digit down. So now we can work out how many times 24 goes into 230. From the top of my head, I don't know how many 24s go into 230, but I do know that 24 times 10 is 240, which is too high, so I'll try 24 times 9. So if I work out 24 times 9, the answer is 216. So I know that 24 goes into 230 9 times. So now I need to find out what's left over. 230 take away 216 is 14. We can now bring the next digit down. Finally, we can work out how many 24s go into 144. I don't know this from the top of my head, so I'm going to do some estimating to help me. I know that 25 times 6 is 150, so I'm going to try 24 times 6. 24 times 6 is 144. So I know that 24 goes into 144 6 times. So the answer is 296. Let's have a look at one more. 8205 divided by 15. First, we need to draw our bus stop. If you have a pen and paper to hand, pause the video and have a go at working out the answer. Write your answer in the comment section below. Now we know that 15 doesn't go into 8, so we need to look at how many 15s go into 82. 15 times 5 is 75, and 15 times 6 is 90, which is too high. So I can see that 15 goes into 82 5 times. So now we can find out what's left over. 82 take away 75 equals 7. We can now bring the next digit down. So now we can work out how many times 15 goes into 70. Well I know that 15 times 5 was 75, which is too high. So I know that 15 goes into 70 4 times. So now I can work out what's left over. 70 take away 60 is 10. We can now bring the next digit down. Finally, we can work out how many 15s go into 105. I don't know this from the top of my head, so I'm going to do some estimating to help me. Earlier, we figured out that 15 times 6 was 90, which I think is too low. So I'm going to try 15 times 7. 15 times 7 is 105. So I know that 15 goes into 105 7 times. So the answer is 547.